We were in, in a data center for a long time. I think at a certain point uh, we um, had uh, audience uh, that was growing faster than our, um, uh, you know, the needs of our audience were growing faster than, than our uh, infrastructure would um, facilitate. So we basically moved uh, piece by piece over, I think over some period of time. So it's not, not disruptive. I think the key to it is to, to keep it at the pace that it's not disrupting your business. And that's because uh, you can't just like, hey, I'm gonna shut down DC and turn this thing back on. Yeah, you just go piece piece by piece. But what um, sort of the kind of, when you move from uh, DC, uh, we, um, particularly our team, um, the, uh, the video infrastructure team, but we have other, you know, the operations, the uh, content operations, and we have, um, other many, many teams that service uh, the audience. Um, and, uh, but video infrastructure team, we moved uh, the transcoding piece um, and we started transcoding uh, in-house, uh, which is, yeah, we've always done, you know, in-house for a number of reasons. Uh, uh, but uh, when we, we were in the, um, you know, in the data center, just not enough boxes available and when you move to the uh, cloud, all of a sudden you have a lot of boxes available, but you're still under the same <laughs> same data center model. So we uh, started re-architecting, uh, rethinking how we're going to approach uh, our, uh, our architecture, and that was the um, I think that was the bulk of the of the effort. Uh, and then once we felt confident that everything is sort of going through the uh, cloud. Um, uh, pathways and then we're you know we're fairly uh, resilient we started uh, turning things off uh, in the data center uh, and of course you know having a deadline helped <laughs> and uh, <laughs> yeah, that uh, and, and then yeah, obviously you know when you have the last box done you're sort of done um, but that that's where we're, we're sad and then as we we were in the cloud you know your imagination is sort of your limit, um, but then we kind of found found uh, that you know there's some limitations to our thinking, and we had to make adjustments as we went, and that gave us a lot of possibilities, and that was sort of over following year, sort of enabled um, for us for a global audience.